Hey guys, Cody at Go Hunt. Uh, wanted to uh, show you a product that we've been carrying for a little bit. Uh, this is a, a company that's you know kind of near and dear to my heart, and that's what's just kind of cool about so many of the, the companies that we deal with is is that they're they're truly grown out of a love for hunting and you know passion for for good gear and 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 sometimes making gear that's better or you know different and and suits their needs and and so it's really kind of cool to end up working with companies like this. But uh, the company is is M U T N T. Um, some people say mutant. I typically just say M-U-T-N-T. They do a great job at servicing their customer, and here's why. They basically give you a package from start to finish. That you've got a bino adapter. You've got a, a three-inch long plate that's Arca Swiss. You've got a, a, an inch plate that's Arca Swiss. A fluid head that uh, actually I've been quite impressed with. I mean, you can use a, an odd, uh, crazy number of optics on it. Um, and it, it, it handles really kind of up to the BTX 95, like all day long, not even, not even a second guess on it. So just, just to break these down a little bit, this is, you can either tip these out or slide them out. This one slides out here, you know, very simple to take off. So you have a stud that actually goes in the, the quarter 20 studs there. Interesting thing about this bino adapter is, is that basically making sure that your binos are lined up with your plate and that you don't ever get that twist on the plate. There's actually two little grooves cut in here that when you set the bino adapter down in there, it's locked in place and can't twist. So that's a, you know, kind of a safety feature and mechanism. Got a, a, a winged knob up here and uh, that works excellent. And you can take that on and off. There is a set screw in there that you can take the top off, clean it out, re-lube it, put it back down in there. And it, you know, it just, it works flawlessly. And uh, it's really kind of been my go-to bino adapter for the last, you know, probably four years now. So uh, I've been very pleased with that and happy. But uh, again, a three-inch plate, uh, a three-inch plate, and a, and a one-inch plate. Somebody might ask, well, why do you use one versus the other? Sometimes I use a, a longer plate because the way that you know I can slide this back and forth, it balances, and I can shift the balance point in the head, and then. Sometimes like if you do, if you have like a, a bino adapter and it has a smaller base, sometimes people would you know just rather use the shorter bino adapter. So it's nice that they give you the option there. Head retails for about 112 bucks. It allows you to pan, you can put tension on it. You can put tension on the tilt as well. And, and, and the thing of it is, is that this head performs bigger than, than really um, you know, what its size says. I think this whole outfit uh, you're right at two and a half pounds, so which is completely mind-boggling because the, the tripod gets up to 70 inches. But again, it's a great all-around, do-everything stable uh, uh, platform that that um, I find myself glassing with more and more. You know, you can take the head off and put other heads on it. So I know people ask that, but the legs themselves super easy to work with. It does come with uh, these neoprene handles. You know, some people like to keep on some off when it's cold. But one very unique aspect of this is they are flip locks and it's super easy to work with them. Just simply close them back in place and you're good to go. They hold real tight. And if you'll notice these, um, I'll show you here in a little bit different fashion. Super, super in line with the tubes. There's not a whole lot sticking up, um, you know, like this way. And so when you go to pull these in and out of your pack or sleeve or however you have them stored in your, your backpack, you know, it's just, it's super uh, ergonomic and easy to um, slide in and out. The tripod retails for 470. The head is, is one, again, 112. Um, you typically have the, the bino adapter for like 79 and the plates, you know, run in that, that $20, 25 buck range. And again, you can get extra studs for your, your binos. There's a couple of other really interesting products out there that Mutant's doing that um, they have a window mount that actually has a swing arm. So I, I would tell you to, you know, look on our website, look up uh, M-U-T-N-T geared and, uh, and you'll see all the products that we carry. If you have questions about them, their compatibility, um, what optics they work with or don't work with. Um, you can always reach out to me at 702-847-8747. You can um, subscribe to the YouTube page and ask questions there, or you can email me at optics at gohunt.com. For your tripod needs, don't look past mutant.